Hey, is your refrigerator running? Yes, it is. Are your doors unlocked? You... What? Why? I don't know. They all kind of look the same. What do you mean, they all look the same? All right, we're Red Shirt, Blue Shirt, and here's a song we call Mommy and Daddy's Room, and we think it's one you can all relate to. When everybody's gone to sleep and you've said goodnight, moon, there's plenty of noise still coming from Mommy and Daddy's room. Oh, Daddy says please, Mommy says no. Daddy says come on, Mommy says whoa. Daddy goes uh, Mommy goes ow. Daddy says I'm done, Mommy goes wow. Daddy, Daddy rolls, rolls over and falls asleep. asleep. Mommy drinks wine in the dark. Yeah, or a T-Rex trying to masturbate. All right, internet porn, check. Tissues, check. Lotion, check. Okay, let's go. Aw. And that's why they were such vicious killers. Oh, he couldn't masturbate because his arms are too short. They feared him from Kilpatrick down to Galway Bay Port. Luckily, he found a wife so he could have sex. The non-masturbating Tyrannosaurus Rex. All right, the Quahog Fair. Hey, Peter, would you get off your phone? Sorry, young girls keep killing each other because they think I'm the Slender Man now. Like, are you... are you telling them to kill each other? It's just a goof. You sure you're not too tall for this? Nah, it's gonna be great. <laughs> Yay! Ow! Who kicked me? Sorry. <laughs> what the hell? My bad. Ow, who's doing that? It's that jerk up there. <laughs> <gasps> it's Slender Man! Kill yourselves. Peter! Come on, it's just a goof. Stewie, I really am sorry about what happened. Oh, don't mention it. I'm just glad to have the whole mess behind us. So what'd you end up doing with those old robots anyway? Well, I just left them out on the curb for the trash man. How can this not be a trap? Big whoop, I can do that. Oh my god, Erica! You killed Erica! Fantastic. So, how fat are you? 240, nice. Oh, Peter, what are you doing down here? Oh, hey, Brian. Stewie kind of took over our bed, so I'm looking for a place to sleep. Well, why don't you go up to the attic? I think there's even a futon up there. Ah, that's a great idea. Geez, I'm glad you came along. I'm going to sleep better than a cartoon sheriff. <laughs> I was in jail because I killed a bunch of old ladies. And now that I'm out, I'm going to do it again. God, it would have been real easy to bring a gun in here. Where the hell did they go? Oh, whoops. That was Patty. She's got a smoking hot body. This is a bigger surprise than when I found out Joe was a clown. I think that belongs to me. I'm sorry you had to find out this way. Okay. You won't tell anyone, will you? No. You can tell people. Sweet. Which movie should I start with? Backdoor Sluts 4. Eh, I haven't seen the first three. I wouldn't know what's going on. Here we go. I want to watch all of these movies non-stop. I don't want to watch any more of these movies ever. Yesterday, I learned the difference between a train and a boat. I wrote this song before that. Train on the water, boat on the track. Train on the water, boat on the track. My lady took a train across the Atlantic I hope it don't sink like the Titanic I went to the station, caught a boat downtown I hope it don't fall off the track and I drown Ladies and gentlemen, the all five foot one Black Albino Choir Train on the water, boat on the track Train on the water, boat on the track
Hey, Brian? Yeah? <laughs> ah! Damn it! Ah! There's glass in my eye! Oh! Son of a bitch! Ah! Mom says dinner's at six. She wanted me to tell people. I don't know why. As a result, I've rediscovered an old hobby I used to love as a kid. Ventriloquism. And I wanted to invite you guys to the opening of my new show at the Quahog Playhouse. Quagmire, we'd be delighted to attend. Wouldn't miss it. Gosh, thanks, Peter. That means a lot. Okay, see you there. Damn it! Why did I even open the door? Ah! Getting excited. Now I gotta go to this thing. Ah, bite me! Laughing already just thinking about it. Only one way to get out of this. Hey, Lois, what's going on here? Oh, it's my book club, Peter. Come join us. Oh, okay. Peter, what's wrong? Well, I want to masturbate, but I'm just so darn cold. Too bad there's no answer for that problem. But now there is. Hi, I'm Peter Griffin, creator of The Yankin'. If you're anything like me, the number one problem in your life is that you can't masturbate just anywhere. But now you can. Introducing The Yankin'. The only blanket with built-in decoy arms. Our patented process makes it look like you're holding the remote or sipping a beer. Meanwhile, your real hands are under the blanket going to town. Peter, what are you doing? Nothing. Let's watch a Scarlett Johansson movie. But wait, here's more. We have Yankets for all occasions. Sporting events. At the supermarket. On the job. Hey, what's going on under that blanket? You'll never know. I'm afraid his behavior has been an issue for a while. He's even been bothering students during nap time. Hey, you up? Guess where I have a crayon. Come on, I know it seems hard, but we can't just give up. I mean, what if Thomas Edison had given up? Uh, what's that? W what's that thing you're working on? Well, it's a light bulb and... A light bulb! Light bulb! Yeah, I invented that. Me! I'm Thomas Edison. I invented the light bulb. Uh, what to do? It lights up a room using electrical... Lights up a room using electrical stuff. I was about to say that because I invented it. Uh, what are you working on? It's a phonograph. Phonograph! Right? I knew that because I invented it. I'm Thomas Edison. I rule! Look it up. Edison was a dick. Wow, I really messed up. I haven't felt this bad since I drove by that speed sign. Bonnie? Joe? How did you find me? Love is a powerful compass. Anytime I quiet my mind and clear my heart, it always leads me to you. Plus, Dirtbag here has a chip in his ear. I do? Damn it, no wonder Peter's so good at hide and seek. You're under the canoe in Quagmire's yard. Son of a bitch! This waitress is prettier than my wife. I could kill my family with a knife. We'll sail around the world by ship I'll give my whole wad as a tip But first I'll kill my family with a knife Yes, he's gonna kill his family with a knife Irregardless of this waitress, I will kill them with a knife Hey, what are you working on? Oh, just trying to make some sense of these numbers <laughs> What the... What, what did you hit? What happened to my spreadsheet? What exactly was the end game if I hadn't walked in? <laughs>